Section 9.3, Perform Reflections. Recall we've talked about reflections before. A reflection is a transformation that uses a mirror line, which is called the line of reflection, to reflect an image. For example, if we have this pentagon. We could reflect it across some line, which will be the line of reflection. When that happens, we get a mirror image of this. So if we were to fold along this green line, the line of the line of reflection, the blue and red shapes should lie directly on top of each other. Um, you have some letters in the alphabet actually that have these lines of reflection. B, you could fold across here, creates a reflected image. D is the same way. Um, o, has these reflections as well, and those actually lead to symmetries, but that's something we'll talk about later. Okay, what we want to do is we want to reflect A, B, C as we're directed below. So we're going to reflect this shape in the line X equals 3. And we have that line of reflection right here in yellow. What happens then is A gets reflected to the opposite side. So since A is two spaces away right now, it's also going to be two spaces away, which puts it at 5, 3, and we're going to label this A prime. B is two spaces away, so we're going to put B directly across on the other side of the yellow line, and we'll label that B prime. C is only one space away, so we'll move C one space away on the opposite side. We get C prime. If we connect these lines, or these points, with line segments, we get the reflected triangle, so the image, which is triangle A prime, B prime, and C prime. Triangle A prime, B prime, C prime is the image of triangle ABC. Okay, how about you try this one on your own? I want you to reflect the triangle in the given line y equals 1. So here is our line of symmetry. Try it on your own first, and then resume the video when you're ready to check your solution. First, let's look at C. If you ever have a point that lies on the line of symmetry, then it stays on that line. There's our C prime. A gets moved down here, we get A prime, we get two spaces away, two spaces away. B is only one space away, so B prime is down at 5 comma 0. And there is our reflected triangle. For this next example, we're going to graph both the pre-image and the image. So we're graphing the original and then the reflection. And we'll set this up in the next video.